Hey, I'm Travis with Gazelle Tents, and I'm here today to show you the T3. The T3 is a very compact and affordable option for car camping and spending time out with your family. So we're going to show you how this sets up and takes down. The T3, like all of our Gazelle Tents, comes fully assembled with no loose parts and is completely hassle-free. As you can see here, we've just taken the tent, the rain fly, and the stake bag out of the bag. There's no other loose parts. So now we're going to set up the T3. In setting up the T3, we want to lay it down, take the strap off, and we're just going to set that off to the side. As we lay out our tent, we're going to grab that wall hub, and as we just grab the wall hub and we pop it out. There's no poles to put together, there's no extra pieces. You grab that wall hub and just pop it out. Work your way around the tent. Once you get to that last one, you're going to start to see that full shape. Now before we pop up our roof, what we want to do is we want to take our rain fly and attach our rain fly. The nice part about these rain flies, again, it's fully assembled. So as we take it apart and unfold it, you're going to see that the posts that are going into the corners here. So we're going to take our post attach it to the corner. Come across with our tent. Attach and just work your way around. Once you have all four posts in, now is where we're going to go inside. So we've got the nice big D door. There's a Bug, sh bug netting in there as well. We're going to go inside, push up in the center hub, and we have just assembled our T3 tent. We can go around, we can strap down all of the um, rain fly pieces to each of the grommets on the side, and then you can use your stakes to stake out the tent. There's nice big webbing straps with a full grommet on each of the corners to stake it out to make it nice and tight. And then it also comes with guy lines that you can hook onto the grommets from your pop outs and stake it out. So if the wind does blow, you're not gonna go anywhere. When we go to take down our T3 tent, we just wanna reverse the process. So we're gonna go around and we're gonna unhook our rain fly from the base. Get those done. And then there's two ways to take down your center hub. Inside on the ceiling is a rope connected to the hub and you can pull down from inside. Another way to do it is just to hit from the outside. Boom, pop it down and now you're ready to take off your rain fly. So you can come around, release all the way around, lay them down and then you can fold up your rain fly right on top so you don't even get it dirty on the ground. Once we get the rain fly, we're gonna be able to take down the rest of the tent again in the same order. So we've already popped down the roof. Now we're gonna go around and we're gonna push in the sides. So you can grab by the hub or you can just hit the posts. You're just gonna pop them in working your way all the way around. When you get to that last side, it's gonna lay down. I always like to put the door back inside, push it in, and then you just fold up your tent, bring the sides in, and that's it. You can put your strap back on it to slide it right into the bag. The bags are oversized, so the tent fits in there beautifully with the rain fly and the stakes, and you're all ready for your next adventure.